stories that are told in the location that an audience is standing. So each story is accessed via our free GPS um, app for smartphones and for tablets, which only unlocks a story when you're standing in the right place. Now, whether they are choose your own adventures, puzzle trails, indigenous myths, or historical tales, each one of our stories are written, scored, and illustrated by local artists who know their cities best. Now, I started this back in 2012 when I used to live in Adelaide, where I ran a pilot project called Adelaide Choose Your Adventure. So basically what it was was real-life choose-your-own-adventures that used physical posters to lead people around Adelaide as they took on the role of a detective or a hero trying to stop an alien invasion. Now, three years on, we are a digital platform. We have a dynamic app, and uh, we can host anything from choose your own adventures to um, you know, self-guided uh, art exhibits. Now, the Story City team is made up of myself, Emily Craven. Um, I've been a writer for almost a decade. I have a very random degree in space science and astrophysics. Uh, <laughs> and I uh, was awarded the, uh, the $25,000 Brisbane City Council Innovation Award back in 2014. Our producer, Grant Mills, is a journalist and editor based in South Australia. And so far, we have employed 31 writers, artists, and musicians in three communities across Australia. So what we do, basically, we are about local people and local stories. So each project, we mentor up to 30 emerging writers and artists and musicians in creating digital art projects for the future, providing them with training and with a publishing platform that brings to life innovative stories that encourage people to engage with their public spaces. We wish to support a future of storytelling where um, the artist doesn't have to move away from the towns that they love and, um, and that they are able to show people, uh, actively engage them within local communities, within local history and, and with their local culture. So at the same time as providing this social impact, Story City allows tourists and youth uh, and locals to immerse themselves in a unique story that basically informs them of local facts, but at the same time just takes them on a fun adventure. In the three years that we've been running, we've trained over 130 writers, artists and musicians, and as I said, we've employed 31 of those across Australia to create the stories that we have on our app. We currently have adventures in Brisbane, Adelaide and the Gold Coast and our plan for next year is to push this out across Australia. So we have four main focus areas. We want to go to regional Queensland, to Melbourne, Sydney and into Perth. And what we're looking at doing is we're going to be guiding the writers to create stories that focus on the unique cultural characteristics of an area, on the natural and built environments of the locations that are around them and on their local history. So our current business model is to work with local councils and philanthropists and business sponsors to fund and create stories which are available free to the public via our geofence technology. But that's only the start of what we want to do. So we are looking in the next two, three years to expand so that we include premium paid content alongside our free content, but also to incorporate educational eye beacon packs into our apps so that we can make innovative, immersive experiences that are also cost effective for schools and museums and for festivals. And potentially in the not too distant future, we're hoping that the app will be able to move to something like a wearables where you don't even need a handheld device to be able to do one of these. Now what we need we want to talk to people who have the same vision for supporting local emerging artists, not just in capital cities, but also in regional communities. So if you're a business or part of local, state or federal government and you want to embrace a platform that enables communities of young and emerging artists and you want to engage tourists and locals with your public spaces, then we would like to talk to you about funding projects. If you are a philanthropist who is passionate about the arts or have a particular cause or um, a particular underprivileged community group, we can help you achieve your impact through story.
So both corporate and private donations are possible via auspicing arrangements that we have with various writer centres around Australia. And finally, for investors, we are developing a commercially viable product that is truly scalable across all cities and regions in Australia and, and frankly in the world. And the global tourist market and the education sector are continuously looking for new technologies that provide immersive experiences that are enjoyable whilst also providing informative and educational outcomes. So with an investment of $150,000, we can hire production and marketing staff over the next 12 months, allowing us to expand regionally into regional Queensland and across major capital cities, as well as upgrade our iBeacon app. So we are an innovative and cutting edge uh, company within this emerging market of immersive game style experiences. And with your investment in us, um, we can continue to be a leader in this area. So thank you very much guys for your time. Yeah. Mm -hmm.